there. What? What's up, my NSAPs? Welcome to my channel. So today, I'm gonna be reacting to Has Been Hotel, season one, episode two, Radio Killed the Video Star. That's an interesting title. Are we gonna see the Alistair versus Vox thing in this episode? Kind of what it sounds like. Also, if you follow any of the like Has Been fan songs, there's that one um, radio song that one of the lines was, Video killed the radio star last night. So if you know that song, it's really interesting to see that title here, but reverse, where it's the radio killed the video star. So anyway, I'm just super intrigued by that. If you saw my first reaction, then you understand that I had paid for the early access to get all these, ep to get the first two episodes early. Um, unfortunately, no matter what I did, no matter what I tried, I couldn't actually get the screen recording of the episode. So I reverted to an option I didn't want to do, but somebody had sent me the link of the leaked versions, which I hadn't seen previously because I'm not about that. I really don't condone that, but it worked as a backup plan because no matter what I tried, I couldn't get these things recorded. So for proof that I did purchase the premium package and all the early access stuff and I bought these episodes. I want to just show that because I am not for uh, using leaks and stuff like that unless I absolutely have to and unless I also did my part in making sure I actually like paid for this content. So with that being said, uh, unfortunately you're, you're gonna see maybe there's like sometimes there's like these little watermark stuff and everything in this version which is kind of annoying um, but I'll try to blur that out. This is uh, January 12th. I am watching it on, on the early access day um, but I will not be releasing these until the episodes have aired themselves um, out of respect for the show as well because I don't want to post this stuff early when it's not even out to the public yet. So uh, that just wouldn't be right. So yeah, um, I enjoyed episode one. Really excited for this one. Uh, before we get into it, don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. Go ahead and check me out on my social media accounts where I post art and other cool stuff. If you want to see the full uncut version of this reaction, you can click the Patreon link down below. And now without any further ado, guys, I'm super excited. Let's get into it. So the extermination is coming in six months instead of a year. No big deal. Ah, uh, very big deal. Things. You had less than half a chance when you started all this salvation bullshit. And now, ain't no silver lining this time, toots. Oh, no, 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 no. We're going back to that. We have Valentino, the asshole himself. What are you writing to Angel? So I'm thinking you and thir th what? Oh, three huge guys are getting it on and it's really hot in oil. And you then, it's revealed you're on a boat and it's sinking so you will... I'll have to do that as fast as you can. Have you seen temperature play video vids? LOL, because there is gonna be ice. So get that flat bony ass to the studio, baby. Excuse me? As you can see, the ideas are flowing. Haha, <laughs> so it's been 30 seconds. Don't be like this, baby. Oh God, this isn't cute, Angel Legit. I'm so bored of this little cat and mouse chase. For real, over it, fucking bitch, babe. This time, too. Angel, what was that last one? Where the fuck are you? Um, I'm not looking forward to exploring the relationship between Valentino and Angel because we've already got the gist that it's pretty fucked up. And I'm very protective of Spider Boy, okay? So let's just not. Mm -hmm. Like I said, everyone's losing this right. shit. Right. Yeah, that's true. Sinners are desperate. Mm hmm. Oh. We'll be desperate enough to try anything to escape the extermination. Okay, the height difference here, though. I don't know why the choice in making Charlie so tall. Maybe because she's part angel, you know, and angels are like big and stuff like that. Maybe I could see that. But like. <laughs> I don't remember her being that much taller than Maggie. It's cute, but Maggie's so little. Also, definitely me in Moscow. She's gonna kill me for that one. Are you really gonna go out in all of this? Well, it's not like people are just going to show up on our doorstep. <laughs> or maybe they will. Oh, you again. Oh, God. I mean, I knew we would see you again, but bro, give it up, man. You are no match for Alistair, period. <laughs> yeah. Oh dear, his mug. Who are you? Who am I? I am the great serpent inventor. They even matched his voice. Well, if all that's true, oh, God. I think I'd have heard of you. Oh. I attacked you literally last week. We've done battle like 20 times. And you've lost well, every single time. Almighty bees will finally acknowledge me as the right. equal. Wait, who are the bees? Oh, uh, nobody important. <laughs> Keeping on the neighbors has never been more stylish. Uh, Box tech. Trust us with your money. Who's trust us with your money. Yeah, I bought your sister, so what is brought to uh, you by uh, Box Tech? <laughs> now that's good television. <laughs> Hello there, 
Mayor Velvet, how are you this oh. Your little boy toy is wrecking my department while I'm trying to pull together a show. And fucking, just get her off here now. Damn it, Valentino. Oh, that's <sighs> right. Interesting. Okay, well, I mean, hello, voice for real. It, it suits you very fucking well. So your little boy toy is Valentino, who's losing his shit because of Angel, who is unfortunately under Valentino's influence is the word we'll go with. Um, okay. Interesting. I hope Alistair kicks your ass. <laughs> or murders you, whichever comes first. Mr. Box, what are your thoughts on the new extermination? I like your look, whoever you are. Uh, the hair, the bangs, the hoops. Hey. Angelic security is coming soon. Trust us with your safety. I don't. Yeah, you just hypnotize everybody. Try to get that bitch Carmilla on the books and cancel all my appointments today. I have a fire to put out upstairs. Uh-huh. Oh, interesting, and he can travel just through electricity like that. What's got him so out of sorts today? Who knows? But he tore up my best model. And you know the show can't wait for that unlucky bitch. Now, Shu, take care of the piss baby. Okay. Wow, that was a whole interaction. And she actually picked the, the worst outfit, in my opinion. I, I like, actually liked one of the ones in the beginning. But you know what? Who am I? I'm not a fashion designer in hell, so what do I know? The ungrateful whore! Um, which whore are we talking about this time? Fucking angel dust! Who the hell else would I be talking about? That fucking slut! Oh yeah, I'm gonna hate you even more. I don't know how they managed to do it, but in just the first 30 seconds of hearing and watching you, I already hate you more! <laughs> oh, cringeworthy. He's just a, he thinks he can run off and shack up with Lucifer's bimbo daughter. Angel is living with Lucifer's daughter now? Yeah, that bitch Chalky Chandler. I don't know, something mannish like that. I, I don't like, I don't appreciate the way you're insulting my babies. First, Angel. Now, Charlie. Hey, Baggy! <laughs> you wanna go hunting? <laughs> Slippery Twink is going to remember who owns him. I'm gonna fuck everyone in that rancid shithole, I swear to God. Yeah, good luck with that. <laughs> Think about it. Mm -hmm. Our brand. You still have him under contract. He isn't going anywhere. True. So, you should... Do nothing? Great idea! Great idea! Oh, uh, who else is there? Someone who owes you money? Alistair. <laughs> Someone who owes us much more than money. Mm -hmm. The radio demon is there. <laughs> Ooh, that was a response. That was a reaction. Ooh. Oh, I hope Alistair wipes the floor with your your fucking flat face. <laughs> oh, the drone can't capture him. I love the creativity behind radio versus video, considering, you know, video did technically kill off, you know, radio and stuff. I mean, now we have podcasts and everything, but of course, there's always that beef. I also love the dynamic of red versus blue. You know, Alistair is red, Vox is blue. They both wear these, like, pinstripe suits, but in the opposite colors. It's, it's very intriguing, and it's very creative, and I really, really like the dynamic. I just hope Alistair wins in the end, which he fucking better. <laughs> Thank you. Why do you try? Why do you try? Does Alistair just love kicking his ass because he never seems to actually murder him like enough to like he doesn't fully kill Serpentius He just keeps beating him up I think he enjoys the attempt that Serpentius has with him over and over again and then just watching him fail countlessly Which is why he doesn't murder him flat out. I love me a man with a giant tool See? Look at how flirts with that guy. And he's not even paying! Who is that? I'm gonna fucking kill this whole fucking family! You're so pathetic. I think Vox is a little more focused on the way his yeah. face was like blurred out. It's been seven years! Song? Pays to Song time? New status quo. Mm. Everyone knows that there's a brand the music. new dawn. Turn the TV off! No, hold on, we're going back. Unremarkable loser, back from fucking off. Smelly, probably. Furry, dumb hair, triangle ass, lame stick, gross who feet, dildo? <laughs> they had so much fun with this. What is the news at the bottom saying? But fucking news is slow today. I guess I'm totally not worried about this guy, and neither should you be. Fuck Alistair! You notice how 
how you're getting so angry and upset about it when Alistair's just so calm and collected still? Like, that shows the true power dynamic here. Who really has the one up? He's not concerned with you at all. Meanwhile, you're like freaking out. I think we know who wins here. Where was Alistair? Why did he disappear? That's what I would like to get some more information on. Oh, so because Alistair said no, now you just took that shit to heart and you just fucking up tight and bitter about it? I wanted to see what that screen said. And Vox has shut down to prevent damage to his systems. The problem seems to be caused by the following file. Alex, Alistair, EXE, Vox, EX, Crash Error, Eat Shit, Alistair, check to make sure all fucking 1930s looking ass hardware and soft hardware and software is up to date and probably properly installed. Ask Vox for any Vox tech uh, updates you might need. If problems continue, fuck you, Alistair. Disable or remove any Alistairs from the general vicinity. If you need to use unsafe mode, reset your Vox tech device press f5 and select advanced startup options then select unsafe mode technical information stop alist alistair old tiny prick radio old tiny prick radio that's funny that's oh, oh shit let's begin Oh, oh shit. Oh, Morgan's gonna love this. Oh yeah, you're so fucking done, Vox. Dude, did you see that demon form? Full on demon form? Even if that even is the full on version, holy fuck. Fuck, look at him, he's so creepy. Ooh, he's so creepy. The stitching. Oh, this will be fun. Oh God, that was great. <laughs> and the laugh. Ooh, that was great, that was fucking great. You need someone who Little Miss Bleeding Heart would take in. Someone pathetic. You. Desperate. I think I have just the one. Which one? Which one? They're fixing the wall. Oh. So, how did it go? Who would want to use their last days not fucking and fighting? <laughs> I mean, touche. Who did he send? Why, hello, my dear. He's gonna be the inside man. That's how you end up here. Oh, great. Great, not looking forward to that. Welcome to our home of healing, our resort of restoration, our- Are you fucking nuts? This chump was trying to kill us like literally six hours ago. Yeah. Aren't you supposed to protect this place? <laughs> I- This is literally me and Moscow, Jesus. Oh my god, they're so Welcome cute. Stop. To the Aspen Hotel. Oh no, darling, thank you. Mm -hmm. This is- Babe, you don't have to show them every detail. Sorry, I'm just so, so excited. excited to be yeah. first real guest. Uh, what the hell am I? Yeah. Uh. It's just nice to have someone interested for once. Oh. Oh, oh that hurt it. Oh, that hurt his feeling. No. Angel X so indifferent, but he's not. That hurt his feelings. Oh, I don't like that. Oh. Oh God, she likes him. Jesus. We're about eighty percent sure she's harmless. And right. Ah oh, yes, you're the one who ruined my coat. I definitely remember you now. Hi. Yeah. Oh, not many people have been able to take even this much off me. It must have meant quite a lot to you. Such a dick. I love now, Alistair. My name is Charlie. I like to sing, and uh -huh. when we get to know each other- I love that when Charlie's just up to her shenanigans and her energy bag, he's just like smiling and adoration. So fucking cute. My name's the Penches. I like to build, and despite my stupid egg boys, I think I'm very skilled. Right. I am too sober for this. <laughs> well, get used to it and learn how to play. This is gonna be your whole day. <laughs> You love a supportive I'm girlfriend. Hey, you. Oh, me. Oh, my God. 
You look like a kid who could use some <laughs> devil's dandruff. Oh, for fuck's sake. Come on, kid. It'll make you cool like me. Mm, what it? The crackhead. The crackhead? I'm off to not have sexual intercourse before marriage. Wow. <laughs> Charlie's so proud, Charlie, no. You poor, poor innocent bean, oh! You poor self. You'll be redeemed in no time. Oh. I, I'm going to bed. Oh, no. I'm so proud of you, Sir Pentis. That was amazing. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Oh, no. <gasps> oh, Fat Baggins, look at the boy, look at the piggy boy. I was wondering if we were gonna see him. Look at him. I have a Fat Nuggets. Wait a minute, where's my Fat Nuggets? I want my Fat Nuggets. I want mine. I got him. I got my little Fat Nuggets. He's so cute. Look at him. He's cuter in the show, but I would take the plush boy. I miss you. Come back. Angel, you bitch. If you don't come home, you will be fucking greasy truckers for the next year. Hey, I'm Orsito. I didn't mean to yell. Yeah. But, you know, chill your whole fucking family. Work's really stressful. Oh, God, I can't. I can't with this fucking relationship dynamic with Valentino. It's so fucking disgusting. I can't with the whole, with that shit. Oh, so fucking cringe. Attic trash like you doesn't change. I'll see you soon, baby. Sorry. Not now, fat nuggets. Oh! Husk? The cat? Oh, oh pinches. You slippery little shit. <laughs> you working for the V's? Oh, shit. Oh, bug. Ooh. Oh, no, this is gonna look wrong. This is gonna look bad. Oh shit, what is that? What is that? Oh no, no truck. <gasps> Did we really just get fucking bedhead Charlie and Vaggy? Like they just woke up from their slumber. Look at their PJs! And the fucking sleepy hair! I love how Vaggy's hair is still just fucking perfect with her bow, and Charlie's just a fucking wreck. Like, you know what? Can we talk about how that is also Moscow and I? When she wakes up in the morning, she's, her hair is still fucking perfect. Meanwhile, mine looks worse than Charlie's. Unfair. I would never betray you. You are my best Oh, Charlie, please. Friend. Please, don't buy this. Uh, and explain this. Oh, the rainbow. Hi. You Oh, thank God. Okay, I was gonna say, I swear if Charlie believed Pentius and not Angel, I would have been so fucking upset. I'm glad it actually played out this way. Thank, oh, yes, thank you. If they don't kill you, go ahead and do it yourself, you miserable failure. Oh, he's gonna stay because of that. I just make it quick, I guess. Oh, not no. I deserve it. Gladly. <laughs> Wait. So much. Oh, yeah, give him another chance. Starts with sorry. <laughs> That's your foot in the door. One simple sorry. Charlie's an inspiration, okay, man? Sorry is where it starts. Oh, I love Charlie so much. Did we just kill him? Shoot him and spill his blood. Oh, That's God. Works for us. No, oh, I love this. I love this. I hated that song. Why are you so lame? Not a bad boy. <sighs> Nifty. First. Oh, here we go. What? You'll have to try harder than that next time, old pal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes! Okay, I'm glad that didn't go fucking anywhere because I would have been like really pissed if that actually would have worked. But it didn't, so yay! That was another fantastic episode. We got introduced to Vox and Valentino, which I'm not a fan of Valentino. I feel like Vox is gonna be fun though just to watch the whole like back and forth between him and Alistair. But I'm pretty sure Alistair's gonna squish him like the bug he is. And then I really liked that Sorry song. And now it looks like we have Serpentius in the hotel officially, who's on the team, I guess you could say. Uh, I really love Charlie's character, just like even giving the worst people like still another chance i love it and it's just super fucking cute and the music is amazing so i am seriously looking forward to
forward to the rest of the season. Oh, I can't fucking wait. I don't know about you guys, but I can't wait. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. Go ahead and check me out on my social media accounts where I post art and the cool stuff. If you want to see the full unedited version of this reaction, you can click the Patreon link down below. I thank you guys so much for tuning in, and I'll see you next time. Bye! Oh,